should be I mean it's it is now can definitely wear it especially if it Hey beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gerardo and I'm a pair. Today I'm reviewing a new wig, so let's get into it. So the wig I'm reviewing today is the Extended Part Lace Big Part Wig from Janet Collection. Its name is Juliana. This is how it comes. And it's in a 613. It has a Swiss leg string deep part. As a natural look, hand tight lace face part, deep soft parting, over five inches deep part, and you can do an up to and ponytail soft and easy style. So this is how it comes. Let me just take her out and let's see what it is about. This wig I bought it from Sam's Beauty. You know I'm I'm still learning to work with wigs, and I bought it in the clearance section, so you probably won't find this wig on Sam's Beauty again. Let me just take her out. To snip her off here. Put it away. And this is a stock card. Like I said, I'm just gonna give you a uh, leave a picture here with the information of the stock cards. Um, he has a general care for pinning heat resistant fiber mm -hmm. and it also comes in available colors uh, well I don't, I don't really know if you're gonna find it because it, like I said it was in the clearance section uh, very inexpensive you know I'm learning to work with wigs but I bought this wig in particular because I wanted to do to do something different so but today I'm simply just uh, checking it out and see what, what we can do with her. Uh, I reviewed the hair, so it's very long, very beautiful. Uh, I've never worn one, and this will probably won't fit, but we'll see. And I know I can get better quality wigs. Probably this isn't the best to start with, but I wanted to go through the whole process, you know. The process that most people have gone through trying to learn how to wear wigs. Okay, so this is the hair. It looks very pretty. Feels very soft. Uh, I'm not gonna finger comb her a lot. Uh, let me show you the cap construction. It has three combs, two in the front, one in the back and adjustable straps here and it's one of those breathable tabs which are good for the summer or a hot climate like mine uh, and this is the part you can see it's very deep feels like it's gonna i won't be i won't need to thin the lace but i won't do any of that on this video because i'm simply reviewing the wig so I'm just gonna put her on, see if it fits my head, because that's a big issue with most uh, wigs, because they're not made for a 23 inch head, which is what I have. Um, but we'll see, it seems very stretchable. Um, yeah, I don't know, but it looks tiny. <laughs> The cap looks tiny for me, but we'll see. Um, let me pin down my braids, which, oh, I have a video of how I make these braids. Um, you can find it here. So I'm gonna pin down my, my braids 
and put her on and try her on and see see what it's all about. <laughs> well, my hair, it's been down. Um, put on a wig cap. Let's just put her on and see what we're working with. Because oh. okay. Yeah, it is tight. Let me just say if I can readjust this. It's tight. So yeah, if you have a huge head like me, which I think, I mean, it's, it is long. You can definitely wear it, especially if, it, if it's, if it's, if it fits, I'm sorry, if it fits. So it's tangling a little. Uh, let me just, I'm gonna brush it. I don't mind brushing it because, like I said, I'm learning and I bought this wig with something in mind. Maybe brushing it wasn't a good idea. <laughs> it was just finger comb. But like I said, I've never worn anything blonde I think the only the, the only time I've worn something that's different from black which I only worn a couple of weeks to see how what it's given besides children of the corn um, yeah 613 wow that's a tough it's a tough color I've seen I've seen other new people wear 613s and they do look good. I don't know if it's because it's clashing with the undertones of my skin that are more um, gold. This is too much of a cool tone. Yeah, I don't know how to make this any any better, but yeah, I will. I will. <laughs> I'm gonna wear this uh, right out of the box. <laughs> But my plan, like I said, uh, just to finish up this video, I'm going to curl this hair and dye it another color just for it to match my complexion much better. Um, I'm thinking of a more of an ashy tone, but we'll see if I manage to do anything. Also, I'm gonna cut bangs because this is basically a hard front wig. It's just have a little piece of lace here. Um, but that's not my intention with this wig. It was very inexpensive. I bought it on Sam's Beauty. Like I said, it's not, it's not a sponsor video from Sam's Beauty. Um, I just happened to buy a couple of their wigs from their clearance uh, section. But if I find uh, this wig and you're interested in, in buying it, I'm gonna leave down below a link for you to to find it and hopefully when I'm done with her I'm gonna have a nice wig to work with um but we'll see uh because it's very tight on my hair um <laughs> so we'll see if I can make her look any better um yeah so stay tuned when I upload that that video because it's uh, I, I have the plan but I still have to figure out how to do all of this uh, I'll probably curl it the same way I curl the copper wig but the dye is the part that might take a little more thinking so yeah well thank you so much for watching if you like this video and you want to see more of my content please consider subscribing and giving it a thumbs up Remember, you can follow me all across social media at Panacros, and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye.